Yes, mate, I'm in the Woolwell Massive. Woolwell, mate, it's like a part of Tesco's, it's the very top part of Tesco's, and uh, it's called the Woolwell Massive, mate, and basically, mate, they make wool and stick it down a well. Uh, so we're going to have a look around the Woolwell Massive, mate. Proper upset them, mate, they'll come at you like the Wu-Tang Clang, mate. So of course, mate, like any place, they've got the old uh, Tesco's extra around here, mate. Save the trip all the way into the Tesco's in the town, mate. And uh, we're going to have a look around the uh, the shops, mate. We're going to have a look around the shops, and we're going to have a look around the uh, um, down at the houses and everything like that, mate. And see what's uh, what's going down on the uh, wool well, mate. Proper. I might even buy myself a bag of wool, mate. So, mate, if you ever ordered like a pizza or anything like that, mate, with your um, double pepperoni. This is where they're born, mate. This is like the uh, Domino's delivery service, mate. Literally, I'm not talking like sort of dropping a baby, mate. I'm talking about dropping a pizza, mate. They're born and raised here in Plymouth. A majority of them come from this part of Plymouth, mate. If you look up near the uh, Southway Massive, the Whitway Massive, or anything like that. So, um, proper. We've got a lot of Bernardos around here, it seems, as well. So, we'll proper have a look here around, mate. I'm thinking to myself, hitting the old little, mate and uh, see what's going on the little massive mate and proper maybe get myself like a like myself a drink or something I do like a drink and uh, proper gonna have a look in there and uh, see what I can get up to then we're gonna have a look wander around somewhere else isn't it? Gone into Lidl's mate gonna get myself a drink mate proper um well I wanna get myself a drink of like drink fizzy mate like a bottle of coke or something like that mate not the stuff you stiff either so um Proper gonna have a bit of pop fizz, mate, and see what's going on, and uh, go for a gander, innit? Well, happy, mate. Got myself some apple juice, mate. Proper bargain, though. Forty-nine p in littles. Ain't bad either, mate. It's quite nice tasting, to be honest. So, um, we've had a look around the shoppies, mate. Uh, got ourselves a simply apple juice with concentrate, mate. I don't know. I'm concentrating on the, the packet, mate. It ain't doing much. I ain't doing much, right? I'm still concentrating on the pack here. No, it ain't gonna work. I might expect it's only 49p. That's why it ain't gonna work when you concentrate on it. So we're gonna have a look around a bit more of the wool well now, mate. And uh, I haven't found any wool to buy though, and I'll, I might see a couple of sheep, you never know. <laughs> Apparently, mate, we're in the um, South Hams Massive down here. I don't know how that works, mate, because we're in the Plymouth Massive. We're in Janahood, mate. South Hams is like in the Top Ness Massive. So. I don't know how that works, but we'll find out. And there we go, mate. There is the wool well massive, mate. This is wool and a well with wool on it, mate. People thought I was making it up, mate, but I'm not. Oh, what's this? We've got a couple of stones down here, mate. I don't know if they've got any magical powers. Well, that's pretty cool, actually. Mate. I do like stones, mate. I do like it, but not in that kind of way, mate, if you know what I mean. So, a couple of stones walking around here. Um, I do like the wool, though, mate. I definitely I like wool, mate. <laughs> Literally, mate, that's, uh, but I'm not a sheep. But they've got a couple of rocks here, mate. And uh, they've made it pretty colourful, actually, mate. And this here, mate, is called a bus stop, mate. Well, everyone knows what a bus stop is, mate. What do you think I am, mate? A mug? Um, well, I am Mugsy. They've got a bus stop here, mate. It's uh, proper all right buses, mate. The 42C, mate. 42C. Bus, mate. 42C in like an hour's time, mate. Um, I do like buses, though, because. They're buses, mate. Do you like buses, mate? I love buses. So we're going to have a look around a bit more of the uh, estate now, mate, and find what else is going on. There seems to be a lot of milfs down here, mate, literally. Proper a lot of milfs. The only downside of this area is, mate, you hear that noise? That's dog barking, mate. Homeowners around here, mate, have installed dogs in their homes, mate, to keep away from, like, nicking their stuff, mate. So I decided to go and do a robbery down there and go and rob someone's house or shed or something like that. I've got to contend with Fidel over there, mate, and that wouldn't be a good idea, mate. Well, uh, unless I give him a bone, mate, and uh, he might get let me off a bit, you know, pay him off with a couple of bones or something like that, or uh, get him on his leash or something, mate, and take him for a walkie. But, well, uh, it's alright around here, mate. I like it. It's pretty chilled out, mate. It's, uh, it's just what I call the, the, the birds around here seem pretty fit, mate. And, uh, Proper uh, problem is though, mate. They're, they're not. You know, they're not like me, mate. They're not. They're not. They're not council, mate. They're not council. But they might just go for a council guy. You never know. Uh, proper. A lot of people walking around here, though, mate. And uh, people seem to be like staring me out a bit, mate. Like, what's he doing over here, mate? He looks like trouble, mate. And uh, I'm like, yeah, mate. What are you gonna do about it? And uh, oh, what's that over there? It's a payphone over there, mate. Proper. 
nicked 20 p's out of them if you're lucky, mate. I've done it before, mate. I've nicked 20 p out of there before now, and uh, managed to get like money out of them before now to go and buy myself like a packet of fags or something. So, mate, anyway, we're gonna have a little uh, look around and um, see um, what's going on around here, mate. Proper, I hurt my leg the other day, mate. I tripped over, mate, when I was running from the coppers, and uh, proper, I feel like I'm like Skippy the kangaroo at the moment, mate. So we've got down here, we've got a place called the Heathers, mate. Obviously a woman called Heather must live down there or something. Hi Heather if you're watching. Um, proper, see what's going on down here then, mate. I've never really explored it down here yet, so it's, I'm curious mate, to see what they've got down here. Um, proper, well they've got an electric shed down there, mate. You're going to get sacked if you go down there. But with proper, it's like one big long road and that's all it seems to be, isn't it? Well, good mate. I just found the gorilla, mate. I just found Nacho, mate. Nacho, mate. And uh, he's got cheese. He's literally got some cheese on it. It's not your cheese, get it, mate? Um, he's good here, mate. Good old Nacho, mate. He's a uh, proper up the gangster around here, mate. He will not want it, mate, with his gorilla self. So we're going to have a little wander now up to the Premier, mate. You've got a Premier. I'm not talking Premier Hotel, mate. I'm talking about the Premier, um, Food place, mate. Woolwell stores. Uh, proper. We've got a couple other Indian places around here, mate. And uh, um, what's that there, mate? The hairdressing company, mate. Proper. Come to think about it, mate. Do you need to get my hair cut? Look at me, mate. I'm getting hair. And it ain't looking good, mate, for me. It ain't looking good. I'm going to, like, soon have an afro on my head if I'm not careful. Maybe people will start calling me Afro Grant, mate, or something. Well, good mate. I just found the gorilla, mate. I just found Nacho, mate. Nacho, mate. And uh, he's got cheese. He's literally got some cheese on it. It's not your cheese, get it, mate? Um, he's good here, mate. Good old Nacho, mate. He's a uh, proper rip up the gangster around here, mate. He will not want it, mate, with his gorilla self. So we're going to have a little wander now up to the Premier, mate. You've got a Premier. I'm not talking Premier Hotel, mate. I'm talking about the Premier, um, Food place, mate. Woolwell stores. Uh, proper. We've got a couple other Indian places around here, mate. And uh, um, what's that there, mate? The hairdressing company, mate. Proper. Come to think about it, mate. Do you need to get my hair cut? Look at me, mate. I'm getting hair. And it ain't looking good, mate, for me. It ain't looking good. I'm going to, like, soon have an afro on my head if I'm not careful. Maybe people will start calling me Afro Grant, mate, or something. To be honest, mate, not a lot in uh, the old. Uh, Work well, well massive actually. Got myself a Pepsi there, mate. Got us a Pepsi. I do like a bit of Pepsi, and uh, thought I'd uh, buy myself one of these and uh, have it to drink of what else you're going to use it for. I ain't going to use it to wash clothes, am I? So, um, proper. Oh no, where's my bus? I think it's my bus going. Damn, I thought it was later in that. I was just been wrong. Ah, bus, mate, ain't getting that one. Bus ain't getting that one. Well, I did manage to get my bus, mate, but I uh, broke my phone, mate. I dropped it. I dropped my phone, mate. I'm not happy. Well, it's working, mate. This is the main thing. Hang on. No, it's not working, mate. No, it's not. <laughs> I don't think it is, anyway. Damn, mate. I think the phone's not even working. That's so annoying. Now, unless it is open. Yes, it is working, mate. So, I uh, pick up the Woolwell Massive, innit? 